blessed morning my people they are again you know why may i tell you know sometimes in our life we don't even know which part we're there you know, man where we stand you know we just have to just whoop say everything work out that are the only thing we have to whoop say everything will work out because may i tell you know a company I give me a warm time right now. That, that company where I work for, I want me used to work for, uh, you know, where I do my liquor final days with. Give me a warm time, boy. You yeah, understand? So the man, them, man, them basically kick me out. You know? Kick me out. The man, them basically kick me out, people. You know? But they never know something when going to rise this quick. They never know. They never rise this quick. You know, yesterday man then come and then they pan and I say, boy, Clive. You know, you have to come back and give you a hand, man. You have to. You have to come back and give you a hand. You can't just left whistle. You know, Clive, you can't just left whistle, man. You may I say, not like say me never try to stay me try to stay you know but them money you know what made them so powerful <laughs> I don't know they are done cars me remember when just last week just last week when when I when me give up my job, what year? I mean, last month. You know? As a matter of fact, before me even give up my job, before me even resign, I beg them. You know, I say, yo, do. You do make me come back and put in some work. So maybe then things say, you know, I don't have no else to go the only place that they have. Maybe then things say, the only place that I have, you know? I would never go anywhere else. For me, kind of dark. I eat that for me, you know? Maybe, maybe that's what them think. Come here, say, yo, look, no man, a long time there, so I might just love to continue. I love to continue, you know, I don't want to. You, you know, you know what I mean? But, why? Rough in a Babylon, people. Because. And them said no. No brother, we can't work with that. We can't deal with that. You know, we only can call you when we feel like. You know, if we have something, if we have some leftover for you, you can get it. Or some pot scrape and gravy and them something, you know. And I said, no, brother. Mr. Mr. Chef, I like cook food. I like cook my own food. I don't want nobody to call me and give me no pot scrape and no gravy. No dip on that. Anyway, you know, I go somewhere else with Pamiki and go cook my own food. And them say, yes, we want your here. Yeah, man, I used to me yet, I see the man come over, man. And the man, the man face look away, man. The man will tell me, say, I want one person he want in a business place. You know, he don't want two persons because they can't pay for that. Well, no, I don't want to pay 10. You can't pay two. Remember, you know. I don't already tell you, you know, so you are alone in a country. You know, it just sound like it's a Jamaican thing, but it's true. It's true. It's a kind of work where when we get the work, Zane, when we get the work, them show me some picture of what some other man do. What I used to do it, and them say, yo, them not like that. They don't want this kind of quality, they want better. And I take them picture that I hang on for them for about a year straight. I hang on for them for about a year straight. You know? And I look at them and say, me use them picture and learn to do that job. When nobody not teach me how to do it. You understand? I never have nobody to show me 
how oh, if you do that something here? Yeah. One time they were saying one man come to show me how to um, put the box together But it was a racist man When the man come and see Say he's a black man he might go work with The man go back in the car and leave The man go back in the car and leave So I said yo, I don't come to do this You understand? Know if you don't want me to do something You don't send me to do nah, real work I don't know why I'm sitting there but Somebody have to teach me how to do it Anyway That man, the man who used to do the work Is a racist man And he not work with no black man So he go back in his car Cause he come you know, with all them tools them, you know, ready you know. He come with all them tools them, ready To show me how to do the work But when he come and buck up man, Who he might go show He just say eh eh I nah, me nah work, me nah work with no black man. I mean, he never said that. But him just say, he never talked to me. He talked to a Norwegian man. And say, yo, he never come and suffer for this. And if them want him to put the box together, then we send the box come a film company. And then we do it over there. So. And if me want to come watch, me can watch. And him going in the car and him drive off. You know, that kind of sound racist to me. Because if I'm here to teach something and you left, you talk to a Norwegian man like you and then you leave, then alright, something is not right. Something is not right. That's and so, anyway, I never make that bother me because of my work. I take time and I get to understand it, read the blueprint. Learn a lot of things and learn 90%. I want nobody never could teach me, and then we go learn another 200%. I want me to learn by myself how to do it and how to make them look perfect and everything about the back of them and me come up with it in my own head. And just imagine, say, me as a customer, I would want to have this. You understand? So maybe the company I will just believe say you know what? Make Clive Galang, you know. You know, he must do him 30 days and he must leave. Because we can um, we can replace him. I yes, let me hear a man come and ball and I tell me say them want him to do the work for the same price. So the man I said me can't talk to them. I mean, as a member, I've been on a point of the company again, brother. Anyway, I try to talk. I say, yo, the man I work every 25 years. Me, I work every 13. And my pay almost double this man's payment. That's not fear. You understand? That is not fear. Even though the man is not a good worker. At 25 years, I contribute to the company. He must not as fast as me, uh, good as me. You know? But the man I contribute for 25 years, man. 25 years the man I contribute for. Or 20 more. I don't know, something, 20 something a year. And the payment where the man I get. Oh God, man. The payment? The payment where the man I get, man. God Almighty. A wickedness, man. Wickedness. We are working on one company so long. And that's what they pay you. So the man tell me how much they pay him, I couldn't believe it. So I tell him how much he asks for. And they say, no, they don't give him that. They want him to do this work. Do this, do this work you want me to do for the same price. God Almighty knows I wouldn't do it. I would never do it. Because Kiss me Ross Clark boy Left me water to Ross Clark God almighty I can't believe this When me just get to work Me never know What me going to deal with Me 
if you understand what I mean when I deal with after long after you know long long after them know have the privilege of watching me do it for almost five years straight thousands of bucks we are making You know? And most of them can't understand how me do that job. And the most important, why? Why you do that job? You get a hundred bucks to make. And then give you a deadline. You understand? Of eight months. And you use six months and finish it. Why well, you try to kill yourself? You try to make your boss happy. And honestly, 90% of the time, I just depend on my phone. I mean, just at work. You understand? But the truth is, it's not an easy work. It's not easy. You understand? Not an easy work. Do I mean? But people, the rough in a Babylon. The rough in a Babylon. Cause the more that thing where you have to do, some people get a glimpse. I owe me put up. Me do me or me do a work thing. Me make a video, make some video sometime. I show some small play piece. Rough man. A rough man. Holy power, man. Holy holy power. I mean, I tell him. But anyway, you know. I saw you going on a life. A life, you know. And we have to just work with it. But the people never know so me when going rise this quick, man. Yeah, man. Rise through the roof. Cause yo, me tell them, I use my brain, you know. I get my brain for use, me use it. And when you think about it, when you look funny, you know. And you go so bamsel and. Me go so bam so I give up my job. And I know so there's a possibility me now get find back a job so quick. Well me don't know if me won't go and find a job so quick, you understand? But what I do know is that I give up mine. The first thing I do is sell the Mercedes, the E-class Mercedes to sell quick. That Mercedes sell quick. But I get that job long before I sell it. But anyway, I sell it. Get rid of it. Because I have a loan from the Mercedes. And I make no sense to have a blood clot car for almost half a million. And then when you look, I y'all don't have to go pay for that bomb clot. And you don't have a job. You know what I'm saying? Even though I never owe so much money, I owe half a while, I buy for. You know, that I pay half, more side already. But I still get rid of it. Quick. So now I go and use the van until, you know. I yeah, make just say, I don't have no credit card, I don't have no loan from this avenue, I don't have no loan, I don't have the next car. So, in case I fall, I'm here alone down at that blood clot. Because the last time I fall, the amount of loan we have, I have car loan, credit card, one next one, I have four books loan, bumble clot. 
and you have chicken no soup until me weak. Yeah man, I'm gonna survive. I don't care, man. Then somebody reach you in a foreign country, foreign country hard when you come on. Uh, yo, nothing in place are easy, man. You have to be careful. You know? But anyway, we have to just, um, we have to just give thanks and just know that Rastafari right is life. And everything work out the way it's supposed to work out. And we can never stop saying give thanks. You know what I'm saying? Big up on yourself and bless up on yourself, people. We're gone.